Hey, and welcome back. Uh, in this video for the next star that I'm building, I'm going to show you how I organize stuff. Uh, good to be well organized when you're building on an airplane. So, the way I organize things is with plastic bags. So, I'll make a plastic bag for the wing, okay? And in it right now, I've got the little uh, black wing bolt that I'm going to use. I've got the uh, uh, permanent flaps that attach to the wing and I got the wing uh, root and uh, so we'll add to that as we need. Um, I've got a box here for the engine. There's the engine, there's the um, exhaust deflector and I'm going to use um, a cover for the carburetor and these are carburetor covers, uh, vinyl carburetor covers that you get from uh, uh, I guess it was Tower Hobbies I got those. Um, Power Tracks um, uh, carb covers. So I'm going to use whatever right size carb covers that is. Alright, so I've got a bag for the wing. Okay. Um, I've got a bag for the gear and in there is the nose wheel, the main uh, nose wheel gear, the main gears and the three um, Dave Brown wheels in there. Got a one for the tank, and that includes the tank, the fillet fuel system, and the um, um, Sullivan filter. Then I have one for the servos. Okay, so there's the servo for the throttle and uh, the servo horns and. Um, the servo horns includes the screws for the servo and in here I've put the Sullivan um, uh, metal clevis and the um, uh, pushrod connector. So I've got a little bag for you need one pushrod connector and one clevis for the throttle and uh, then I did the same thing for the rudder. Got a rudder, um, a servo, uh, arms for the servo and uh, but for the rudder um, you need one clevis for the rudder but you need two push rods one for the nose gear steering and one for the rudder so I got um, that in this bag so I've organized the stuff that I'm going to need when I'm ready to build it so I don't have to be looking for it uh, elevator again um, servo, servo uh, arms, and the quick connect and um, clevis for that. For the ailerons, uh, a little bit more. Uh, because the ailerons uh, need the um, T-horn, the, the control horns, got two of those, got two servos, got two um, servo um, arms. And in here I've got two clevises and uh, the two quick connects. So, um, uh, oops, horns back in. And then um, for the receiver and battery, um, I got my foam. I've got some extra foam from the last airplane I built. So I'm going to use the extra foam first before I open up a new box. I got my Velcro, got my battery. Got my uh, servo uh, extensions that will connect to the um, uh, radio, I mean to the receiver, um, and telemetry module and all that stuff. So that's good. Okay. So now what I want to cover is how to organize the stuff that came with the airplane. Because this bag is full of parts and they're not all for, for one thing um, as this is. So, I'm going to take a pair of scissors and open up the metal parts first. Okay. I'm going to change the angle of the, of the camera so you can see this better. So, I'm going to empty this out. And then, um, I've got a whole bunch of small plastic bags, okay? And I'm going to sort these by uh, what they are and what they're for. 
and then organize them in a plastic bag. So um, I'm going to do that and then uh, show you the results. So I'll be right back after I sort all these uh, metal parts here.